And I actually remember uh, at my level one, Boz was there, Kimmy was there, um, a good handful of staff was there. And I remember telling, telling them, I was like, yeah, I, I want to go to the CrossFit Games. I want to compete there. And I remember talking to a couple of the of the coaches now, and I mean, now I'm on level one staff, and I'm very grateful for the opportunity. But looking back, and they said, you know, you you and other participants would tell us this every weekend, but you actually went out and did it, and you achieved it. And it's for me, I think, if I have a goal that I want to achieve, I'm going to put it out there, and I'm going to work as hard as I can and do whatever I can possibly to reach that goal. And so from 2011 to 2015, now I think back, and it's been a long journey, but a majority of the credit almost all of the credit goes to Alex, my boyfriend, and he's been able to kind of coach me from the beginning um, and help me kind of form my plan and my agenda to be able to get here. And it's been amazing because there's been ups and downs in terms of learning movements or not being able to do stuff. I remember when I first started working with him, when we first met, I was at CrossFit One World and I was throwing a tantrum over like a 95 pound snatch. Like, I look back <laughs> and I'm like, I wanted to snatch 100 pounds so bad. And then now I'm able to kind of see, wow, I'm able to do muscle ups and snatches in a workout and rep them out at 95 pounds when that, not that many years ago, I was stuck. But I think that's the beauty of CrossFit is you being able to look back and reflect on, hey, this is where I started, this is where I came from, and no matter who you are, at what level you're at, that that's something you should always remember. And that's something I, I try to always keep to myself because it's like, I think people kind of get ahead of themselves sometimes. And it's like, man, you have so many people that look up to you as an individual, as an athlete, as a coach, as a, as a per person in CrossFit, and you want to help them as much as possible. And that's what Alex and I have kind of dedicated our lives to, is being able to help people, whether that be trying to get them as a competitive athlete or just trying to get someone to live a healthier lifestyle. Because CrossFit is, I find in a way, is the kind of the preventative <clears throat> care for a lot of people. Oh, for sure. Versus being like, hey, you're, having all these diseases, let's give you this pill or that pill. So I know I just talked a lot right there. No, that's okay.